A fever is usually a symptom of something else going on. It's not a condition in itself. That means that you need to work out if you need to treat the underlying cause of the fever rather than the fever in itself. In fact, if your child is perfectly well and has a mild fever, then you don't need to treat it. So a temperature above 37.5 is considered to be a fever, but a child under three months who has a fever above 38, you should be seeking medical help. And a child between three months and six months old who has a temperature above 39 degrees, you should be seeking medical help. Otherwise, you should seek help if your child has a persistent fever, is severely unwell. So, paracetamol, ibuprofen, except in chickenpox where you shouldn't use it, and lots of fluids and cuddles will usually help. But it is important to seek medical help if your child has any signs of sepsis. Now that would include having a seizure, having a rash that doesn't fade when you press the glass against it, if they're short of breath, clammy, have cold skin, or if their skin is looking sort of blue and mottled. If they're very, very tired, and sometimes they could be very cold to the touch actually, or boiling hot, but with very cold hands and feet, or if they have severe tummy pain with the fever, or if they have severe shivering, confusion, get dizzy, have slurred speech, and so on. In addition, if your child's under five, you also want to look out for them not feeding for any length of time, a lot of vomiting, and no wet nappies within the space of 12 hours. All of those could be a sign there's something serious going on, and it is important to seek urgent help. But don't worry, there's a very good chance your child has a simple viral illness, and by tomorrow, you'll be exhausted from being up all night, and they'll be running around just fine.